Hello everyone, this is Dr. Dan from Access Analog, and today I'm going to answer the question that we get asked most often, which is, how is your software plugin different than everybody else's? And in order to answer that question, I'm going to do a demonstration. I've pulled down from the internet a software emulation of the Pultec EQP1A. And what I mean by emulation is, at this moment, what's happening is the audio samples from my DAW playback are going to this plugin. They're being manipulated by some algorithm in the CPU and sent back to my DAW. So it's done in the box, all in software. Now, how's that different than ours? And if you've not seen this before, I'm about to blow your mind. Ours is very different. You can think of our plugin as a portal. And it's a portal to two real EQP1A units that we have in our Boulder, Colorado server. So the way this works is my DAW is sending the audio samples. Those audio samples are being streamed over the internet and go through a digital to analog conversion. They go to the real EQP1A units we have, back out through analog to digital conversion, and back to your DAW for playback. Not only that, you have full control of the EQP1As via our robotics that are connected to those hardware units. So as I turn these knobs, the robotics are turning the real knobs on the real units. So this is done for every piece of gear that we have, and we have a wide variety of gear. We have compressors, limiters, equalizers, uh, a lot of SSL and Rupert Neve uh, multifunction boxes, saturation, reverb. So if this is something that's interesting to you, go to our website, download our free plugin, create an account. Once you open up our plugin, you have to add your credentials. You press connect, and then you have access to all this equipment right at your fingertips. From our racks to your tracks, Access Analog.